Hi, Phil Scarito here. Today we're gonna cover the hollow position for the push-up, okay? Now, I'm gonna show you what I see a lot in the setup for the push-up position, okay? Notice my low back sags, okay? Meaning my pelvis is tilted. So when I'm in this position, my abs really cannot fire. They're not really working to my advantage in the push-up, okay? So one way to correct this is we're gonna use a drill where we're gonna be on our backs, okay? And we're gonna use a cue where I tell you to pull your belly button to your sternum. So this is how we're gonna set this up. You're gonna find a safe position to lay down in. The first thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to tell my student to pull the belly button up towards the sternum. And what that's gonna to do to the pelvis is it's going to shift it this way. So really when I do that, my low back is pushing really hard into the deck. So I like to start in this position with my knees bent and feel the belly button pull up towards the sternum and I can now feel my low back push into the floor. So I cannot get my hands underneath my low back. So once I've established that, we're gonna make this a little bit harder by extending one leg. Now as I extend the leg, this is going to be harder to maintain. I'm still thinking of pulling the belly button up to the sternum. I'm breathing through my nose, out through my mouth. I'm not holding my breath. If I can successfully do that with one leg, I'm gonna then go to two legs. So I establish my position here, push my low back into the floor, extend one leg out. If I can do that successfully, I'm going to extend the other leg out. Notice, when I'm in this position, my body looks like it's in a curve, right? I'm not here with my back, which is what my push-up looked like. Now I can clearly get my hand through, okay? So I wanna shut that down by doing this, by pulling with the belly button up to the sternum. So, how do we apply this to the push-up? We're going to do that drill, and then we're gonna test it. So how we're gonna test is we're gonna get into the push-up position again, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do the same thing I did on the floor. I'm gonna pull the belly button to my sternum and watch what happens to my low back. Now, I feel my abs engaged. Now the goal is I have to maintain that as I go through my push-up. And if I do that successfully, I now have my abs helping me in the push-up, okay? So this is the position we want to be in. 